Hello, hello guys. I hope you are doing good. I'm here to finish or to give you the second tutorial for Base Building Plus. On this one we are going to do some advanced stuff like I'm going to show you every single part of the system. How can you uh, like set those? How can you use it? What's the difference be between a roof and a floor? And all you need to start building your own base. So the first thing is I forgot to tell you something about how to use this before using your base is ready you have to be careful because you have to place a code lock one of these okay look at this this is a code lock it's used to like lock your your doors so you hold it in your hand attach code lock here and set a passcode you can use letters or numbers I'm gonna use just a number like some random okay that's a secret password so now it's set look so if you don't have the password you won't be able to open this specific door so enemies will uh, will need uh, explosives to destroy your door and raid your base okay now let's start so I'm gonna place more wood here I'm gonna first run through the first uh, tier tier one wood so you can understand how it works on this server where I am the purge anarchy there is a restriction you can only raid through doors you cannot destroy any roof any floor any wall so that's very important because you have to design in the server you have to des de design your base based on on um, on the, the the amount of doors that you have but okay so be careful with that okay let's start t1 wall kit we already have a t tier one wall half kit that's obvious it's just uh, a half wall i'm gonna create one I'm, on, I'm not gonna build it i'm gonna just gonna show you look so there was a server restart right now i can't build look at the message to the left you need to claim this land before you can build here that happens because of this you have to enable construction and once you enable construction you will be able to build look I'm not gonna build all oh, it's built so but it's the same I'm gonna disable this you can use this to cover behind or to fix some tiny holes like these windows or or you can snap also this so it's just a small part it's very good to build like uh, like fortress on the roofs or to cover tiny holes is very it's very good but I, I don't need this so I'm gonna disassemble it it works exactly as a, as a wall so every time that I that I speak a, about a wall or every time that I talk about or I mention a, a wall it's the same for a tier one or any other tier half wall piece so that's why I'm not building one of these okay next we have we have the roof kit this one is important I'm gonna build right now the also the floor kit okay this is the first confusion for people because they look the same I'm gonna just place this here on the floor I don't need more bricks right now so they look like they're different and they are different but they look really alike so I'm gonna build a floor first so I'm gonna attach the floor so I want a perfect base so I come here I look at the wall prompt I already clicked look at the bottom left on my screen here is not deployed now here is deployed but it's missing it's around me that's that's very confusing for some people when they're building a base because they cannot find the blueprint or the ghost I, I call it the ghost it's a hologram that like that other one that is in front so I press B and with this B I'm gonna snap on and start moving this so look what it happens it's being attached I don't know why okay this is perfect you, you see you have to play with this so you can get this right right now this floor it's not deployed it's not on, on the uh, it's not created just for me to make sure that it's it's okay it's perfectly perfectly aligned with this one this one here this this wall so I'm gonna place it 
then I'm gonna use I'm gonna place some materials in it so I need planks I need logs okay you know what I'm gonna use something it's an admin hatchet I'm part of the staff of the the anarchy server so I'm using this admin hatchet I don't need to place materials this is the same I just want to show you the difference so I'm using this you won't have access to this but I want to to, uh, to create a short video and this is a roof what's the difference come here remember look at the wall deploy this okay the first difference if you noted I was on the floor on the floor hologram when I was building it yep so I was on the floor and the prompt was under my feet but on the roof the prompt is over my head you have to be careful with that look at this yeah I'm using the admin hatchet remember that I'm just building everything with my magic because I just want to show you so what's the different the difference I'm using a different hatchet right now and look I can dismantle this floor from above like here should be the prompt to disassemble this floor from if I'm standing on it I don't know what happened here I don't see the prompt but on the roof look dismantle wooden roof from I mean standing I'm standing under the roof why why is that important because of this if I teleport here imagine that this is a roof of your base and someone jumps on a helicopter or, or he use a ladder or bar uh, barrels to jump in look I cannot destroy the roof if I'm standing on the roof that's the difference between the roof and the floor that's the real difference so I cannot destroy this with a hatchet I will have to use explosive or something else but if I jump under the floor I mean the roof sorry the roof I will be able to dismantle it from under so that's very cheap and we can dismantle I don't know what maybe it's because of this it's glitched into the land so I'm sorry for this but you, you, you could be able to destroy a floor standing on the floor but no standing under the floor so I'm gonna build two more right now to show you the difference and the possibilities you have okay again the roof kit and the floor kit one here oh what happened to the floor kit oh I need more of this I have the the roof right here and remember press K now other floor and I'm running right here why is this important guys you could ask okay that's obvious no it's not obvious some people they take a roof kit remember this is a roof and they snap the roof to another floor because they don't know the difference right now let me check where is the prompt I think this floor is booked I know this sucks that's why I, I like to stream my building and my tutorials because I can help you to fix some of the problems you see I have to look I have to, to crouch a little bit to see the prompt closer so I can I can spawn this. So once more. Look at this. This is really important. I cannot build. I'm sure that you are you, you know why, but if you are wondering why I can't build, because this is a roof, so I should be under the roof and I can be inside the earth so I can be inside the, the land on the terrain so I cannot build this so when hap when the confusion happens the most common confusion is this one someone placing a floor close to a roof so it looks the same but look I cannot build this floor from standing under the floor and in the same way I cannot destroy the the wall the floor I mean the, the floor from under so I have to be above so I'm gonna teleport here to show you really really fast how to use this okay look 
I can't stand on the blueprint because it's a floor. So you can build bases in the air with no problem. You have to be careful because if this were a, a roof, if this, if you use a roof for this and you step on the blueprint, you will fall because it is a roof. There is no collision. But this is a floor, so there is collision. So I can build this. So people think that this is the same. They look I mean, very similar. But I repeat, I can dismantle this from here. So if you build your roof with floor kits, this is going to happen. An attacker, a raider, is going to come here with a hatchet and start. And he will start doing this. Look at this. Hello, and Sama. How are you? Hola, hola. Oh, remember, guys, I have a weird accent because I, I live in South America, so I speak Spanish. I don't speak English, so sorry for the mistakes. But yeah, this is what it happens. Someone can destroy your base from above because you picked or you selected the wrong piece. So you have to be careful. If, if it's your roof, use the roof. If it's a floor, use a floor. So if you want uh, a base with many levels, a first level, second level, three levels, use floors all the time. Yeah, if your door is under the on the first level. So if your door is here like this one, just use floors. You can and for the second level you can use floors also because there will be a third level, a third layer with a roof. That's very important. So now I know that you know the difference between floor and roof. I'm gonna keep with something else. And that something else is right here I need more materials. Here's my M16. Here's more materials. Yeah. So it works the same. I'm gonna build two because I like those. Tier one roof hatch and tier one floor hatch. It's the same principle. The same principle than before roof hatch. The roof is it's going to be on the roof, of course. It's the last part from your base to protect him from above, especially from raiders, especially from drops from a helicopter. So that's that's the, the really important part here. So you have to be uh, careful with that. So I'm going to build both of them here. The Purge Anarchy, this is perfect, so I'm gonna take this kit, okay, let's build the roof hatch first, look, that is great. So, I'm gonna build this, so what's the difference between this? This is going to be your last, oh, this is a roof, so remember, I have to build a roof standing under the blueprint right here look there's the prompt over my head because that's a roof so what happens with a floor i'm gonna snap the floor remember press b to get a perfect location so everything is aligned so this and this other door yeah so what's the problem here i'm trying to build right now and i can't i can't do it because that's a floor so I have to come here you don't have I mean it you can't teleport I do it because I am an admin and I, I, I want to teach you but you will have to be very careful having barrels having stairs to do this so look I can't stand here with no problem and here's the prompt build wooden floor look at this yeah that's perfect what's the next step for both so remember if you have a helicopter or if you have to to be able to defend your base from the roof build one of these because they will have to destroy these with with a uh, explosive and not destroy this floor with a hatchet from above okay now one of the other problems that we find every day every day in the server is people trying to build a hatch or stairs look at this remember you, you look at the prompt you can click it next part wooden stairs you need to place more materials stay here look at the interface 
look at my mouse you can place more materials and you're gonna get this you have to to be careful and to pay attention wooden stairs you don't have to to get a stair kit a different stair kit that costs more resources you can just place more resources in the kit in the and you can get this stair this stair is perfect because it's smaller than the 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 regular stair and it's very nice because it's perfectly attached so there won't be any book what kind of book if you use if you use the 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 stair the regular stair and you glitch the stair through this wall you're going to die or glitch or get stuck into the building that happens a lot of oh, there, there's raining outside oh, I love this building because I'm not wet so you have to be careful and this is the, the uh, this is cheapest than getting another kit and building a different stair it it happens the same with the roof but I have to be here and build wooden stairs this is the same difference and the same performance with tier 2 and tier 3 floor hatches and roof hatches this is the same so next step is this okay remember this is a roof my mistake so I have to be under looking at the center I mean the prompt is right here in the center under the stairs It's not on the corner so if you go to the corner you won't see any option you have to stay here to see the options look at this this mantle hatch and it's the same for this but I the prompt is on the same spot where I cannot build standing under the, the floor but I can do it here look build hatch perfect I hope to be to not be a trap so remember if it's the last level on the top of your base use the floor the roof hatch and if it's an internal level or the first one use a floor why because if your door like in this base this example base the attackers are going you, you need to use your imagination imagine that there is a a door here so they have to destroy this imagine that there is more doors and if they reach here I want a floor because they won't be able to destroy it with a hatchet from under so yeah and that is the same way if I have a helicopter and the only entrance to my base is a helicopter I don't want this because look at this if I stand here I will be able to dismantle this with my like any other floor dismantle it look here's the prompt it's kind of sneaky sometimes but look at this it was here yeah I can dismantle this from above with a, a hatchet a hatchet worth 3k that's cheap that's trash but an explosive costs like 500k so it's a huge difference your base is going to be like you're raiding your base it's going to be really expensive that's the difference now guys so yeah I will do and I, I, I will tell you so this is the difference between roof and floors and roof hatches and, roof and floor hatches so let's see what's next remember press K pilar this is this is like some kind of decoration the gate and the door you already know the difference between gate and door I'm gonna show you the the stir kit this is the one that I told you that you have to avoid except if it's for external use do not connect a ladder like this with a hatch because it's glitchy look it's really glitchy so you could you could glitch in your own base or it's a mess so but if I want to climb on the maybe on the roof let's try here with this let's see what happens if I try to look now it is snapped so I can build it let's see if I can no I can't so same principle place the materials in the interface get close look Mm, this is an interesting problem so if you don't see the menu or the prompt to start building this it could be um, a lot of reasons you can do that open your inventory until you see it but you will be able to do it that's glitchy that's part of the mod they have look you can stand in front with the material in your hand and place attach 
and once you do that you you won't be able to see the menu but you you must be sure I mean I mean you are sure that the materials are in the I'm missing some nails so I'm gonna use more nails remember in your hands and click it so the enough materials are there so you stay here look build stairs and now you have a stair so use this for external purposes or if you don't want to build walls or hatches around because sometimes these stairs are really glitchy okay so I can come here so to to jump into my roof this stair kit is perfect but it's not the proper if you are building indoors so try to avoid that that's my rule I mean it's not a uh, an official rule but that's my rule if I have a floor hatch or a, a roof hatch I use the internal integrated uh, uh, stir and if I don't if I'm building outside or far away from any of those I use this stir but don't place I repeat don't place stirs this stir inside one of those parts because it's really really glitch so let's keep doing I'm responding something okay this is the live the life of an admin so perfect now let's see what else do we have remember press K uh, this is done this is done I'm gonna get a piler anyway and I'm gonna spawn more wood because I'm gonna need more planks I'm sure about it plank wooden plank, stacks of 20 on on the ground perfect now I have oh I think that I have a huge huge problem look I'm glitch yep my interface is not disappearing let me see if I can like well it's not disappearing so I'm relogging really really fast sorry for that it's okay I'm logging in again that happens when you have so many systems in your in your game but th that's what we need to admin the server okay I'll be in in 15 seconds so that's what I like to to record my tutorials on live with people on the chat on my 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 twitch if you're watching this on YouTube or any other pl of my platforms uh, I record everything live on twitch so you can see the real experience it's not uh, there's no edition that's nothing pre-made just it's on live so I'm I'm having the same issues that a regular player are having except for this one because I was using the admin console but I just want to fix any because sometimes people get disappointed because they have a tiny mistake they forgot some something tiny so I want to do it live so follow me on Twitch guys follow me on YouTube Instagram and Facebook or my website I'm working on my website right now I'm sure that if you see this video my website is going to be ready but it's not ready yet but you can follow me on TheMentor.com Not yet, remember, not yet I'm recording this on January, so... I'm sure that at the end of January my website will be ready But now it's not ready So, let's keep with this Perfect So, a piler I think that I already have a piler This is a gate, you already know what is this A wide ramp This is something special that we have for you piler kit and a white ramp I'm gonna show you fast what, what is the piler for I mean I have to be honest with you, you oh, that was a goat that goat almost killed me it scared me a lot 
I'm gonna talk to him. Hello, Mr. Goat, how are you? No, okay. He's not very friendly. He scared me, though. But I'm not gonna kill him. I, I, I don't have... Hungry, I have enough food, so I don't have to kill him. So, this is a piler. I think it's for decoration or create cover or just to place bases on on there. I, I'm not sure, guys, actually, but I just want to build one to show you how it works. It's the same. Look, the same work. Well, that's new for me, guys. We are learning together. Okay, this is a wood piler. Interesting. I don't know what are those for. If you're watching this video, I'm sure that on the description I'm gonna investigate what are these pilers for. Maybe, yeah, I'm sure that they're for building a base, like in the sea, so you can place one of these in the water and then the base and the floors above. So I'm sure that's how it works. Okay, and a wide ramp. Wide ramp, it works. I mean, I use that especially for cars. It works like a stair, but look at this okay let me see I'm just gonna place it like here I don't know if it's aligned with the yeah I think it's aligned okay this is the ramp so same you have to place the materials I'm using my magic hatchet just to finish the video fast and look this is the ramp you can use it for you or you can use it for your cars so you can have a garage on a second floor or not there or maybe there's some problem with the terrain so it's not like stable or flat so you can use this ramp to move your cars to your base or any other place so that's a ramp for I think there is no tier 2 or nor tier 3 ramps and I want to make sure remember come to the workbench per K tier 2 yeah there's no ramp and tier 3 there's no ramp yeah so this is the most complete the tier 1 this is the most complete from all over the 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 tiers but it's the less the weakest yeah it's the less resistant from all over the tiers but it is the cheapest one so my recommendation you can build your walls and your floors with wood tier 1 and build only your doors with tier 2 and tier 3 I love tier 2 that's tier 3 that's better but it's your choice you can have your base as you wish so that's enough what's next so we have some walls I'm gonna show you about the already finished interface or prompt or the menu for okay, look at this if I press there is some attachments this is the this this is very important this is the attachment and uh, like tab so there's four different attachments so what is what are we, are we going to put in this attachment first camo net like in the vanilla now you can have on BBP you can get some I'm gonna get barbed just a few and light Christmas light so I have to come here remember if you don't have the menu look what is happening right now that's what I love I repeat I love to do this on live because that could happen press L so look L in your keyboard L from long that's an L. So, cam on it, you place it here. So, now let's look with my free camera. So, you can hide an entire base inside some woods, even on the roof. That's, that's awesome because now you can place the camo on the roof, like this one. So, let me see if I have another one. Oh, I don't have. Oh, yes, I have one more look at the attachment on the roof tier one look this is the name these are like the the tabs to deploy the menus and look at this so 
now. What do you think that happened? Yep, I can open this door and look at this. Only the roof tier 1. What's the problem with this? I'm gonna test something with this roof hatch. I'm not... Yeah. The problem is roof hatch you can place camo on a roof hatch that sucks I know I'm sure that base building plus will fix this as soon as possible and you cannot do it on this either why I don't know I ju I'm just wanna I just want to test again just to be sure yeah there is no camo for a, a roof hatch and there is no camo for a floor hatch so that's a problem but there is camo for all the doors like this look so camel and the other one I want to show you everything so you have a an example of what are you looking for for your base so I need one more camel net yeah so look at this So they, they have different uh, slots for different attachments, so that's on you, but look, look, this is very important, look, the, the door is really hard to see, this door, if you are like 200 meters fighting on that base, you are raiding the base, it's really hard to see, yeah, I mean, you have to be looking right in front, then fix this book, if you look, you have to be ready that someone is opening that door, so that's really interesting for a sneaky escape or a sneaky defense that does not happen with the gate remember this is a door what is a gate the gate is the big one so look at this so right here it's all also camel look I can hide with the door remember that this gate is not very well placed because I place this on a window where you can go out but y you see it's easier to see, even with the rain and the fog, it's really easy to see that someone opened the, that door or the or to see that the door is open, so that means a lot. Or you can, that someone is trying to, to go out. So you have to be careful when you choose if you're building doors or gates. I prefer, I mean, I use both. Sometimes doors when I need uh, like a, like a tiny trap or sometimes gate when I have to use a car or I need the gate for to have more uh, space to join so that's on you guys that's entirely on you what do we have any other attachments of course there's different attachments but mainly they like the wall ones so this is my favorite I know you're gonna love this I'm sure about it you're gonna love this I'm start spawning, spawning this on the ground barbed just a few and barbed wire and light christmas light i'm sure that i'm gonna need a generator a generator and cable cable and a cable reel, just two in case, perfect. Okay, what? Remember, there's no wall menu, L, and you will see the menu. So, Christmas light. You can place the Christmas light here. This light, we don't know. This light, it's not available right now. We don't know why. Maybe it's the server, but you cannot place on this, nothing on this slot. So, it's not ready yet maybe the developer but I need a spark plug what you can do is like placing this look I have a generator I plug this in and I drop it on the floor, so they, they're both connected, I take the light from the wall, 
look I'm I plug the light in the cable reel and then I come here and I place the light now the light look at this it's tiny but you can see it it's really tiny so if I turn on the power generator look what is ha what it happens so there's light that's awesome because if you don't like the night vision I don't like night vision so I, I like this or this is important because if you are getting rated in the night and the look at the night vision so look what it happens it sucks because it's really bright for my night vision so you can play with that to annoy the attackers or the defenders also so look look what ha what it happens I'm turning this again okay it's impossible to see if there is a window something so night vision could be uh, could help you a lot while you're defending your base so use flash flashbangs fire and this kind of light so that's how you use the attachment of these things there is different attachments let's let's see the, the gate so there is a gate right here yeah there's a code lock I, I'm not using this you can place like more lights but not the lamp you see there's no lamps no, uh, or, or other type of light a slot I don't know why and let's see finally this one here yeah there is no I mean yeah we have a light I don't know how to use this light that's very weird that's a mystery if you know just let me know on the comments below I'm finishing this this tutorial for now and then I'm gonna record the third when I'm gonna teach you how to build in some ideas for your bases so thank you for watching me guys remember I recorded this on the Purge Anarchy server a high loot tier a high loot server uh, you can find those on DA, uh, DCSA launcher as the Purge Anarchy so see you later guys and I'll see you in another video